divisibility by 4. The last two digits are divisible by 4. On the right side, we have a side note of the multiples of 4. First, let's have an example. We have 2,877. Remember the condition, the last two digits should be divisible by 4. In order for a number to be divisible by 4, the first criteria is it should be even. And an even number ends in 0, 2, 4, 6, and 8. 2,877 ends in 7 which means that it is an odd number. Therefore, it is not divisible by 4. Next, we have 7,794. Check the last two digits, 94. 94 is even. Now, we can proceed to check if 94 is divisible by 4. By just looking at our side note, we cannot find 94. But what if we don't have a side note and we are on an exam or a recitation in class? The first thing to do is to focus on these three numbers, 40, 60, and 80. We are certain that these numbers are divisible by 4. Now we check what is the largest number that we can subtract from 94, and that is 80. Now 94 less 80 Again, we subtracted 80 because we are certain that 80 is divisible by 4. The answer is 14. If you have memorized your multiplication table, you will know that 14 is not divisible by 4. Therefore, 7,794 is not divisible by 4. Next, we have 5,156. We will check, is it odd or even? Yes, it is even because it ends in 6. Next is we check the three numbers that I have already highlighted, 40, 60, and 80, which is the largest that we can subtract from 56, and it is 40. 56 less 40 is equal to 16. Again, we subtracted 40 because 40 is divisible by 4. We end up with 16, and we know that 16 is divisible by 4, which means 5,156 is also divisible by 4.